everyone, welcome to the Green Monk Sustainability Customer Reference Series, sponsored by SAP. With me I have Dr. Hubert Nortz from SICA. Uh, Dr. Nortz, can you tell me a little bit about SICA as an organization and then your role within SICA? Okay. SICA is one of the uh, global players in the area of uh, specialty chemicals. Uh, we are in the uh, construction market and in the industry. Uh, for uh, construction market, uh, we uh, produce uh, mortars, uh, admixtures, sealants, adhesives, flooring products, uh, products for uh, roofing and roofing systems, for example, uh, to fix uh, solar panels uh, on roofs. Okay, and your role within SICA? I'm responsible for product stewardship within uh, the SICA group and uh, I have a second role uh, in the uh, company of SICA Germany. I'm responsible for the uh, management systems, that means uh, environmental management system, quality management, uh, safety management and uh, a very new initiative uh, concerning sustainability. Uh, that's uh, energy management. So how does SAP help you with those jobs? SICA uses SAP across the organization uh, and uh, in uh, my area, product stewardship, uh, we use uh, mainly SAP EHS. Um, SAP EHS helps us to um, create safety data sheets uh, to comply with uh, transport rules for dangerous goods management. Uh, we produce uh, our product labels out of the SAP system and we use SAP for the recycling of our packaging materials. And what's the requirement for using a system as complex as SAP for producing something like a label? Uh, the labels uh, contain all the, um, all the safety information you need uh, by law to be compliant. We and uh, the uh, information uh, concerning specific uh, aspects like uh, CE marking, like uh, recycling logos. Uh, we have more than uh, 100 different uh, certification and, and uh, um, rule specific logos in the, the SAP system, which will be pulled right to the right uh, label for the right product. So, uh, you mentioned recycling, how does SAP help you with that? For example, Sika has a, a huge variety of packaging uh, and uh, for each different um, fraction of, of uh, for each different uh, material, you have to pay a different amount for the uh, recycling of the material and uh, SAP helps that uh, using uh, the RIA module uh, to calculate the different parts, the weight of the different parts and the cost for the recycling for the different fractions, the different uh, materials uh, to do the uh, total calculation uh, for the uh, packaging recycling which is uh, mandatory by, by law to do that. Okay, and you mentioned uh, transportation rules, what, what's, what's that about? Uh, if you ship products to your customers, uh, uh, there are very specific rules um, and you have to comply with that rules for safety on, uh, on road, safety uh, in the air transportation. SAP provides uh, the uh, possibility to, or to provide the information for your customer and to create all kinds of reports on the delivery papers um, for the uh, forwarders of uh, the um, products, etc. And how are you going to handle the reach legislation? Uh, we use um, SAP EHS uh, in the uh, extended way to uh, uh, comply with the uh, chemical legislation reach in, in Europe. And uh, we are on the way to, uh, to enhance the uh, SAP EHS um, system with uh, sub-reach compliance engine and uh, with the uh, substance volume tracking module which um, we are convinced uh, it's uh, the only thing in our area to enable us to fulfill these requirements. So uh, how are you finding the SAP services? 
Uh, we are working since uh, many years together with uh, SAP, since uh, the early 90s, uh, and uh, in my area, SAP EHS. Uh, we appreciate very much uh, the uh, flexibility and the expertise of uh, SAP. And uh, in the past, um, the uh, requirements we had, uh, SAP tried always very hard to fulfill, and uh, we were very satisfied. So finally, what are your plans for the SAP product set going forward? After the uh, rollout in our main companies like uh, Switzerland, uh, Germany, uh, Austria and North America, uh, they uh, will uh, extend the new SAP template all over Europe. That means the uh, next rollouts will be for our companies in UK, Czech Republic, Slovakia and Hungary. Uh, following by uh, France and Italy and uh, all uh, other European companies will follow soon. Great, that's been fantastic, thanks a million for coming on the show.